Ishmaelites or the Ishmaelites or Elamites. He sent us straight to our people, man. All right, go ahead. Verse 18, when I say unto the wicked, thou shalt surely die, and thou givest them not warning, nor speaking to warn the wicked from his wicked way to save his life, the same wicked man shall die in his iniquity. So in other words, if we don't come out here and do what's needful for us, we're going to be held accountable.
for the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through the most high to the pulling down of strongholds, casting down imagination and every high scene that exalts itself against the knowledge of the most high, and bringing into captivity every thought to the obedience of Yahweh Shabbat Hey, so there it is. Get you up, get you up, cast out the stubborn block from away from my people. catch this okay if you uh if you google jesus but you google yahweh shy and, and a dark-skinned man will show up that that's uh depicted as the bible uh has it you know yeah, the of the scriptures that you can go check it out for yourself i just want to uh, just, just go into those strongholds a lot of strongholds in here do what thou will every man for himself get money all these 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 are strongholds are
find us, man.
set up to destroy you jinx the whole time. Y'all got it? Isaiah chapter 30 verse 1. Uh -huh. Woe to the rebellious children, say if you have by Shem Shai, that take counsel, but not of me, uh -huh. and that cover with a covering, but not of my spirit. Yeah, meaning they don't want to listen to the, what the prophets say. You know? Basically, we gotta we gotta be the uh, uh, the, 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 the necktie, the suit and tie wearing, uh -huh. you know, bald face, bald head. Gotta have millions, you know. Yo, gotta be able to Google, Google their name and see their net worth to, to see if they're you know, worth listening to. You know? Versus the Lord speaking through vessels that look just like you. You know what I'm saying? They don't want to seek counsel from the Heavenly Father, man. So that's why the Lord's gonna leave them to their own devices, man. You trust in the system, this system is gonna be the death of you.
in the in the mind of Jake, it looked like Esau was really gonna follow through with his new world order. Yeah. It looked like Esau was gonna really set this thing up where he's gonna he's gonna be winning. Jake wanna be on the winning team. So ultimately they're gonna choose the, the, what they perceive the winning side. Yeah. Yeah. They don't think that we're gonna that he's trying to accomplish it seems to just be going left it's sloppy, sloppy as hell that's why the scriptures say is, is, is the wisdom of teeming a, a perishing it seems people just able to decipher and figure his shit out every day even just a regular average person you know so he he's on his way out of there he's losing his uh his grip he's losing influence other nations are no longer uh in fear of him anymore they're building up their own uh military uh, uh weaponry they're building up their economy outside of the petrol dollar. You know, hey, Iran, despite all the sanctions they get, they still get a, a trade. They still make their uh, money with, with trade. They ain't worried about the uh, U.S. sanctions, man. The, the, the alliance that they have with uh, Russia, as long as they're tied with them, they, ain't, they really ain't got nothing to worry about. You know, and that, and that goes into the, the Lord raising up the spirit of the Medes, man. You know? So this devil is getting set up to, to lose in a major way. Alright? Yeah, 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 yeah. Read that again. Yeah, I'll read it again. Back in Isaiah chapter 10 and verse 20. And it should come to pass in that day that the remnant of Israel and such as are escaped of the house of Jacob should no more again stay upon him that smote them, but shall stay upon the Lord. The Holy One of Israel, in truth, the 
remnant shall return, even the remnant of Jacob, unto the mighty power, Yahweh Bashem Yahushai. Back in my quick point, sir. Unless you know, limit is seating only. This thing is limited, like you said, esoteric. Everybody can get in, and it's for a limited time only. Alright, so if this is uh, for you, you better hurry the hell up, man. You, you should already be signing crime within yourself, at least. If you don't know that the prophets are out there and you can see what the prophets have been uh, speaking about, that you don't want to hurry the hell up and get up out of here. Okay? That's that's the job we're, 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 uh, we're out here to do. To hurry up and say, uh, we, we kept public yesterday, right? The harvest is plenty, but the labor is a few. We really, we really need more workers to hurry up and bring the harvest in so we can get the hell up out of here. That's how we, the minds that we hastening the day of the coming of the Lord. Yeah, I will watch me outside. Revelation chapter 20 verse uh, 4 And I saw thrones and things that sat upon them And judgment was given unto them And I saw the souls of them That were beheaded for the witness of Yahweh Shai And for the word of the Most High Which had not worshipped the beast Neither his image Neither had received his mark Upon their foreheads or in their hands And they, and they lived and reigned with Yahweh Shai a thousand years Gate for, for uh, 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 why is, why is the, is the, why is the gate. 
gate and broad is the way that lead to destruction and there be many that go in there at well yeah the lord made the the, the, the broadway very uh, spacious well you're going to see most of our people they're going to be going that route they're going to go the most convenient way the lord told us follow not a multitude that do evil that's that uh, a multitude that's going to perish man we don't follow the Now they're, they're back in the world full wholehearted. That mirth, the little moment of, of mirth, seems to be um, refreshed them back into the world. Versus that bitter spirit that says, um, what does it say in, in uh, Ecclesiastes 7? It says, um, go, better to go to the house of mourning than to the house of feasting. What's the one about mirth to say? It's better to do what is second one is talking about murder. Fourth the sorrow is better. Your sorrow is better. He got it. Just let us read it, bro. We can chop it. The heart of the wise is in the house of mourning, but the heart of fools is in the house of mirth. Exactly. So we're already mourning for our people. We're already mourning for our lives on this side, so to speak. You know, for our lives on this side, but we seek a, a, a kingdom to come. We're, we're, we're not concerned with this side. So we're trying to wake the people up like, man, this shit is going down. It's going to go bad. So so chop this up, sacrifice this time now that you may have eternal uh, 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 life and glory on the other side. Okay? That's what you should be leaning towards, not towards another Mother's Day you know, Sunday gathering or whatever, another uh, single to mile gathering where everybody getting drunk and eating good and feasting, not knowing that this sword is being sharpened destroy you people. Hey, hey, people gonna come to that to that Mother's Day party or whatever, uh, you know, dinner or whatever, with the jab in there. They gonna have all of that and not know what that jab's about to do to you. They got everybody in, eat that, that nasty, uh, uh yeah. Because they, the, they, they, they got it. And they they're passing it. it around. around. Yup. is coming for our people particularly the time of Jacob's trouble but it's gonna come and hit the whole earth but it's really gonna hit the two-thirds of our people the majority of our people so we have to warn those that they may uh, seek repentance and salvation to turn their ways around you got it, it says, verse 10 it is sharpened to make a sword slaughter well, it ain't sharpened just to say look how sharp my ninja blade is now nah, this is because he's gonna use it the Lord is gonna come through and use it now what's that sword Sword. How Shai gonna show up with the chariot and just, just zap people? There's gonna
gonna be just martial law, uh, doing things, you know, uh, taking people out. Time periods, like I said, in the days of Noah, men were eat, eating and drinking and giving and giving the marriage. Those same people are going to be taken away by this sword. Yeah, I mean, when you think about it, the scriptures say, "Let us not sleep as do others, but let us be uh, sober." When you when you're in the constant mode of mirth, you know you 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 drinking and, and, and partying and trying to have fun, your mind is far from being aware. You know, how could you? Be a watchman and not be aware. You partying while you on the watchtower? <laughs> you turning up while you supposed to be sitting up there and, and warning Israel that hey, hey, harm is coming, danger is coming, the enemy is coming. You know? No, so you gonna be sitting there and, and that's I mean that's your your, your occupation is to watch, pay attention. Get pleasure, and in his end, his deeds shall be discovered. Mm. That's why you never know. That's why the scriptures say, "Don't put, uh, 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 don't put off, uh, put not off uh, from day to day." The notorian to turn from the Lord, man. Put not off day to day. The Lord can, can get your ass when you in your security, man. When you think shit is sweet, you know, it ain't. It is not gonna be sweet. You know, I'm, I'm, I know you don't want to hear nothing like that, but it is what it is. We gotta be the yeah. But it's really good news. 
spread the gospel. Hey, guess what? If you was in jail, but you had to go through a, uh, 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 what's it called? Uh, um, where they fight in jail? Uh, gang, uh, fight, uh, uh, oh. A riot, a, the water, a riot in jail to get out, you know. But you knew how to how to maneuver around and stay away from the danger because of, uh, you know you had a guard or somebody pretty much guiding you through where you don't get caught. Then so then you're able not to be in the skirmish and you can get out of jail. Isn't that better news? Would you rather go through that and not have to serve a, a life sentence? Well, that's that's what we're talking about in, a, in, a, in an analogy. Of, we're talking about breaking into the Lord coming to rescue us out of prison. But of the times and the seasons, brethren, you have no need that I write unto you. For yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. For when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them. As to fell upon a woman with child when a woman's pregnant, she don't know. She just, all of a sudden the water busts and she got these uncontrollable pains. To, uh, as to fell upon upon a woman will tell and they shall not escape but ye brethren are not in darkness that the day uh, should overtake you as a thief that was the point i can keep going on time as the fishes that are taken in an evil net and as the birds that are caught in a snare so are the sons of man snared in an evil time when it falleth suddenly upon them